To learn music from home, subscribe to this channel and press the bell button. Namaskar, Naman Pranam to all of my dear students, music learners, listeners and lovers. Myself, Rachna Mehra from Canada, Toronto. Welcome all of you on my YouTube channel, Rachna Mehra. Today, in our vocal class, I'm going to teach you Rag Bhupali. Rag Bhupali is one of the basic rags like Yaman and Bhairav in Indian classical music or Uttar Bharati Sangeet. Rag Bhupali is a very important rag for beginners because it has a very simple structure and also very easy for beginners. This rag is also very good for voice training and riyas also. That's why this is called one of the basic rags. Rag Bhupali is originated from Thad Kalyana. In this rag, we use all Shuddha notes. Shuddha mean notes means the notes those are sitting on their original place. Shuddha notes. In this rag, Ma means Madhyam, Ni means Nishad. These two notes are not used. Therefore, the jati of this rag is considered as Adav Adav. As I have told you before also, when we use seven notes, it's known as Sampoon Sampoon. When we use six notes, it's known as Shadav Shadav. And when we use only five notes, then it's known as out of, out of. In my previous uploads of ragas, we have already discussed about the jati. So I'm not going to go on the details of the jatis in this rag introduction. So coming back to rag Bhupali, in Indian classical music, which is known as Uttar Bharatiya Sangeet, a rag must have at least five notes. Otherwise, it won't be a rag. It might be called anything else like uh, any song, dhun or any other thing. But it won't be a classical rag. It might be anything else in light music hmm? and vadi swar of this rag is ga means kandhar and samvadi is dhaivat which is dha vadi samvadi is ga and dha the time of singing this rag is considered as first part of the night uh, but some of the artists also consider as the second part of the night also. Nyas Keswar In Raghupali, Nyas Keswars are Sa, Ga, Pa, Shiraj, Gandhar, Evam, Pacha. Nyas Keswar means a resting stations of Rag journey means uh, while coursing this rag mm, our voice can take rest on these notes that is the purpose of Nyaski so, mm, the nature of this rag is very sweet and melodious in this rag we need to Remember only one thing. Though Dhaivat is Samavadi of this rag, which is second important.
important note but we do not pause on that note tha means tha is not considered as a nyaske so so we cannot we cannot take rest on that note means you should not take breath so try to avoid taking breath on that note but you can use that note a lot only the thing is you cannot rest there means you cannot use that note as a nyaske this rag bhupali is expanded in middle and lower octave do rag bhupali is sung in all three octaves lower middle and higher octave and if we expand this rag in the higher octave there are more chances to match with other similar ragas that's why when we use higher octave we got to be very careful especially for dhabat which is samavadi so raghupali is known as purvangavadi rag because the vadi swar of this rag is falling in first half of the middle octave which is gandhar that's why this rag is known as purvangavadi rag in this rag we can sing dhrupad khayal tarana and light music songs also rag bhopali is a very famous and very common rag for all types of singing rag bhopali is known as mohanam in carnatic sangeet so this is a little short introduction of the rag now i am going to sing the basic movement of the notes in the rag known as aru means ascending order of the notes avaru descending order of the notes and pakar the most catching notes of the rag so
this morning. I'm just repeating this again. Because I'm not satisfied the way how this sounded. I'm repeating it again. Da
Click the subscribe button below. Also, make sure, make sure to, to click, click the bell button and turn on your YouTube, YouTube notifications to watch, to watch videos, videos as soon as, soon as, as they are posted. posted.